guys, we really are trees. Okay, so this is what mycelium looks like, which is under the substrate of soil. And this is what fascia looks like, which is in our body. Yeah, and mycelium is like a network. It's a soft white web connecting different plants and trees and ecosystems together, sharing an electrical information and nutrients, holding the earth together. Literally, it holds the earth together. And fascia is also known to hold the structure of the body together. It is like a three-dimensional collagen matrix that moves through every cell and holds it together. It gives us structure and it's like a water gel-like substance that carries electrical information. Um, it's the river of the body, right? It carries emotions too. So when we are in a nervous system state of immobilization, dorsal vagal, the reptilian brain, that's what that is, not that. Um, we, when we disconnect and numb out and to freeze, we go into dorsal, the fascia is constricted. If we are in the sympathetic brain, which is kind of the emotional center, the sympathetic charge of danger and um, fight or flight, right? Also the fascia is constricted. But when we are in ventral vagal, which is the upper brain, and the neocortex, the place of consciousness and reasoning, then we are in a state of safety and calm. And this is when we have experiences of Christ consciousness and expansion. So consciousness expansion is directly related to what state of nervous system we're in on a regular. And the more we are in the ventral vagal, the more the fascia can flow and carry the biochemicals and release the biochemicals that give us an experience of expansion. I'm going to be talking a lot about this tomorrow at Birthright. I'm so excited. So comment Birthright below if you want to know more.